case against that bus driver charged in connection with this frightening crash is growing. More charges may be on the way after her bus ended up dangling over the mass turnpike. And the eye opener's Jim Loke is in Newton this morning with the questions being asked. Well, nobody can forget those images from over the weekend and take a look. There is a new guide rail in place here on that overpass. The big question investigators want to answer right now was the driver using her cell phone, which would be a total violation of T policy when her bus went through that fence. It's been just two days since Shanna Shaw's bus was left dangling over the pike in Newton. Now investigators want to see surveillance video from the bus, and they've issued a search warrant to examine her cell phone. Sources tell Team 5 investigates Shaw initially told detectives a sneeze caused her to lose control of the bus. She was questioned yesterday at her home in Mattapan, but there's no word on what came out of that meeting. Her driving record cites three crashes over the last 20 years. All of them show that she was at fault at the time. The most recent happened last month in Dorchester. Now, right now, Shaw is being charged with obstruction of justice. She's accused of misleading investigators. She's also being cited for speeding and operating to endanger. A lot of charges, still a lot of questions to be answered. For now, live in Newton this morning, I'm Jim Loke, WCVB News Center 5.